Morning, Boggy here. So, the title of this is probably will end up being a raw chi. Uh, the title of this is Love or Fear, Your Choice. There was a great uh, video from Gaia, Gaia TV, which uh, I shared about an hour, hour or so ago, and it talks all about collective consciousness. Hello Jane, hello Paige. Uh, yeah, so collective consciousness. We are all interconnected. We, you are the creator of your own reality. It's really, really hard for a lot of people to get that, to understand that first, that you are, what do you mean, you know, oh, I'm not, how can I be the creator of my own reality? There are things far bigger and more important than me out there. But you are the creator of your own reality. Martial arts, in meditation, and in Qigong and Tai Chi, especially, they start off with learning to uh, breathe. And they learn your breath. They learn through the breath, you can relax the mind. And through relaxing the mind, you can relax the body. And so on and so forth. So, again so so martial arts and tai chi firstly you learn to be the creator of, of your own internal reality now in the law of attraction what you focus on grows so if you can focus if you can be if you can you know be aware be confident of your own inner world that you can create things in your inner world like for example medical case studies heck of a lot of them out there Ah, oh, Baz, Brianna, hello. Um, yeah, medical case studies is that your mood, your emotions affect your health. So if you, you know, if you think you're going to be well, you will be well. I've over the years have heard a lot of people who, who believed they were ill or said they were ill, Matt, um, and they made themselves ill. You can make yourself ill, you know, by thinking it or through emotion. So, you know, this whole thing that I say a lot, if you're the creator of your own reality, starts off from inside, starts from the very beginning. And the way you think and feel affects the way you are and who you are. And it can affect your health and then it can affect other things. If you wake up grumpy, if you wake up um, not happy, well, that will channel how your day is going to go your day will continue in that direction if you wake up happy and looking forward to new things that are going to happen in the day that will channel the direction of your life it is in a weird way that simple or that complicated what you do in your reality what you think and feel affects your reality it's the very much Taoist thing of uh, the free ones, or uh, Qi uh, Jing Chen, or the three M's, which is martial or fitness, med, uh, medical or healing, and meditational. Is what you physically do, do will affect how you feel, and will affect how you are. So you can just simply through breathing you can affect your body, your mind and spirit. By moving, you affect your body, mind and spirit. So, students of mine know that we joke about, or we do a thing called um, Tai Chi, well like Tai Chi ironing, or Tai Chi, uh, Tai Chi walking, Tai Chi doing the dishes. Um, and that is all about, is it is feeling the body focusing on what's ten do you have tension inside because the tension inside will affect your emotions and the tension inside will affect your your life your way things are because however you're feeling it internally affects you externally so for example one of the simplest uh, most, most powerful exercises I teach which is twist the waist is that twisting the waist teaches you to be rooted to be centered grounded on the bottom half of your body but to be flexible in the top half of the body so you'll adapt to situations but you still remain firm you still remain fo focused well what's matt's put uh that makes total sense dude 
I need a good personal tape personal conversation with you but friend Matt always here for your brother uh, I love your uh, Instagram photos they are really really cool um, you ever want to chat uh, private message me I'll give you my number my um, and we'll talk yeah, always here always here in some form hello Louise it's Lou hello Lou right um, yeah so there's so in that that's uh, episode of the, the Gaia it talks about the interconnection of the universe that we are all one what does, it, what does that mean we are all one we are all interconnected that each of us affects everybody else you surely there's been times Chris surely there's been times where somebody's walked into a room who's very very happy and it's lifted that room somebody walks into that room he is very upset or, or angry and he drops the room people's emotions affect everybody else you, there are case studies um, from the FBI and, and other agencies where they have had uh, a number of people practicing meditation and in a city and they did it for a weekend then they didn't realize they were doing an experiment they did meditation in the, in that city for a weekend and they dropped the crime rate of that city by 20 percent they've done it with a massive amount of people and it was said to have dropped for that period of time that they were meditating um it dropped the world crime crime rate and terrorist rate by 70 percent um, and these are case studies. These are actual proper case studies that the FBI did and other agencies. So we, they know we are, Robert, Mark, they know we are all interconnected. That every one of us affects everyone else. So we are really what We truly are one. We are interconnected with everybody else. You are the creator of your own inner reality. And... Through that, Steve, and through that, you are the creator of your outer reality. So the inside affects the outside. But hey, what do I know? Okay, I think that's enough for now. So, take care. Bye for now. Love, Chi and Shen. See you for boggy.